Okay, we're back to Let's Play Kirby Superstar, Great Cave Offensive, and I've got Stone, and instead of Cutter, I've got Ninja. Because I believe Ninja, with its slash, can cut those things apart. But let's go and see how true that thing holds. Yeah, I can do this cutting motion attack, so I believe that'll work. And if I can get my helper to stay alive long enough, and not run into any damage that can come to him, which is pretty difficult when it's as stupid as a rack, I should be able to get through here. There. Now let's see what's in here. Well, there's Mir up there. Um, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to get it, but I will get it. With this, I can deflect the laser he shoots and actually hit the guy through the wall. Up here is a treasure. The treasure turns out to be King's Cape. Not sure what game, but I'll figure it out one day. Maybe. Missing two more treasures in this part of the cave before I go back to the other part of the cave where I'm missing three treasures. Do I go back through here? Yeah, I gotta have to fight that boss. I might not have to fight him, but I'm assuming there are treasures there. I mean, there's a boss for. Anyway, if you get back here, you gotta blow that up easy enough with just the water gun, which is what Kirby will have if he's underwater. Now we go through here, and the max tomato I already picked up, but it's not here, so... What boss are we facing? Chameleon Arm! An enemy that can eat you. Like so. You can roll around. Stick to the ceiling and turn invisible. When he's invisible, he still can take damage. He also spits those balls at you. If you follow the balls, you get paint ability. Very rare ability in the Kirby world. But I killed Chameleon Arm. And my partner died. And there's Max Tomato. That could have healed me and my partner. But anyway. Okay. I'm going to take Burn London, because I'm assuming Burn London is what I need. Uh, let's go up here first. There's a door. Inside this door we find candles. And a switch. Okay, I get the point of the switch. It opens a door somewhere up here. I'll take it. Yeah, there's this probably a switch. Yeah, there's um a door. <gasps> Excuse me, there's a door under that switch. And I have to hit the switch with something to get up there quick enough. So I'll turn my mirror into the burn London and get this because it's attack is quick. So, let's wait, see if I can get this right. I can get to the door, I just can't get through it in time. my helper was smart enough or fast enough, I could probably open that door and get through it in time.
close, but I didn't get it. Yeah, the next five minutes of the video might just be me trying to get to that door. Hey you, fire guy, over here. I made that. Everyone saw that I made that. There we go. This door takes me to a treasure. The treasure is a model ship. There's a lot of money for a model ship. Ah. Uh, I'm missing one treasure in this part of the dungeon. Let's see, down here. Death. Don't want death. But there is a max tomato. <clears throat> so. Let's continue. Upward. To another max tomato for some reason. Let's destroy that. And go through this door. We are at the beginning thing again. Where did we come out of? There was nothing to come out of. Oh. Okay. Okay. Don't fall that fast. I know I'm in somewhere. There's a door. I think it's the only door around here. If it's not, there should be another door somewhere. Over here. Or over here. No. This is the only door. Which means I've got to take the other way. Up here. There's a door over there, but that probably takes me back to the beginning because it's a double door. So, through here. Oh yeah, I know what I gotta do here. The torches are out. That doesn't really mean anything. There is a door in this room that I cannot see because the torches are out. So in London, who's that? See, there's the door. It's invisible, but it's there. You can't see it unless the torches are on. Look at the other ship, and I get the sun ring. Same the same price as the model ship on the other side of that thing. So I'm done with this part. There's only three treasures left in the dungeon. They're all in the next station of the dungeon or whatever. Get up here. There. Come back here. There. And... With that, we're through the door. Back to here. Which I don't want to be, but... It's not like there's much of a choice. Yeah, I'll go through here. And use the cannons. You can shoot me straight up to that door up there in the middle. Or just fly there. It's easier to maneuver. And take me back to here. So, that's it for this part. Um, I still missing the objects between Ramsey Scale and Spirit Charm, as well as the last treasure in the dungeon. But I've got most of them. Um, and this really expensive katana. Uh, in the next part, I'm going to be able to get those treasures. See you then. Bye.